Hey TikTok, this is Lions Den with another news and commentary. Kitted Pylon, a Michigan doctor, has been charged with a federal hate crime after targeting black people by leaving a, a string of threatening notes and nooses in his wake. Now, before I read this article, this article comes from the Atlanta Black, black Star, by the way. Remember the Buffalo shooter and his manifesto when he said that the organization is in the millions and the groups, the hate groups are in the thousands. And honestly, you don't even know who's a part of this organization. Whether you have a, a doctor, a lawyer, a police officer, or maybe a politician. Well, I believe this is what he's talking about. So you got a guy... 61 named Kenneth Pylon, who's a local Michigan doctor, targeting black people in the community with the news and a threatening note. Now, again, this article comes from the Atlanta Black Star. It says a Michigan eye doctor is charged with federal hate crimes for targeting black people by leaving a string of threatening notes and nooses in his wake. Regina Simon of Saginaw, Michigan, and her husband at the time allegedly were victims of Kenneth Pylon, 61, who authorities say targeted the mixed-race couple by placing a noose in their truck with a note attached saying, Accessory to be worn with your Black Lives Matter t-shirt in July 2020. Okay, so Terry Pruitt, Saginaw's NAACP chapter president, was one of the first people that Simon's contacted while this incident happened. Now, here's my question. Why they waited now to charge this man? And I know a lot of people in the black community complaining about this guy doing this. And they, and they finally ch charged him after all. This incident happened last year. Or two years ago, I'm sorry. This incident happened two years ago. And now all of a sudden, you want to charge him with this federal hate crimes? And I know there's going to be a lot of complaints by the people in the black community about this guy, but they're not taking this story seriously until now. So TikTokers, tell me what you think about this. I mean, this are, this to me shows you that they waited so long to get this guy. And, and again, they should have got him when that incident happened, which was in 2020. Y'all let me know what you think about this in the comment section. I'll talk to you soon. This is Lions and Sign Off. Deuces.